Okay, so if you're a tech person like me, you know that on the iPhone 5S, the 6, 6S, 7, and 8, they all have a glass home button. But I've seen so many different durability tests, and none of them seem to break the actual home button itself, even though it is glass. So, I was wondering, what does it actually take to break the home button? If you're wondering why the home button is on this piece of crap Samsung phone, um, it's just because I'm going to be doing a couple drop tests onto its face to see if that will break it. Um, I really want to know what will it take to break it. Um, and then I also have a rock that I will be either hitting it with or just chucking at it just to see what will happen. Just so you know, the phone itself is just to add weight like a normal iPhone would. So, yeah, I'm also not going to do any slow motion just because <clears throat> it's pretty much a stupid little video. And I just really want to see what it takes to actually break it. So, I'm going to be dropping it onto this concrete right here. And, yeah, first from waist height. In three, two, one. Let's see what happened. Oh, well, that's what it takes, apparently. Oh my god. I actually legit did not expect it to break that easy. But it did. Holy crap. Um, I don't know how well you guys can see that, but th th that's completely shattered wow oh my god but as you can see it is made of glass so um yeah there's your proof i guess all right so for kicks and giggles i still have the rock i'm gonna hit it i i didn't expect it to break so easy but it did so by the way this was for a six if i did not say that already um so yeah, in three, two, one. Oh, now it's over here. Oh yeah, that shattered a lot more. Here, hold on. If my camera will focus. Since it fucking loves to, doesn't it? Oh my god, I hate this camera sometimes. There, now you can... Maybe you can see I don't think you can really see that. Yeah, now you can see it. Yeah, that's how much it cracked. So let's keep on hitting it. Because why not? Wow. Alright. Oh. <clears throat> okay. I just tried to pick it up and the, the button itself just fell off. It just... It's just like, nope. Never mind. Nope. Okay, so there. You can see the fingerprint sensor. I don't know if anyone's been able to see that before. So... If I'm the first, then hell yeah, that's cool. But, yeah, I I just, I can't believe how easy it broke. That's kind of ridiculous. But, yeah, there's a good look at the home button, or not the home button, but the uh, the fingerprint sensor that's underneath the glass. So, there you go. I legit tried to pick it up like this. I tried to pick it up after it like broke in a million pieces and I just ended up picking up this instead of picking it picking up all of it so <laughs> you can see all the little glass shards right here too. So that's that's not good. Um but yeah anyways it was actually really easy to break it. Now will this happen to you if you drop your phone on the face? Most likely not but it's always good to know what will happen in case you actually do. So, the, I don't think that w that would happen, you know, like, as easy as it did. But keep in mind, when I had it on the phone, it was resting above the screen. So, because I couldn't get the home button out from this one to put it flush. So, that's why. That's mostly, get, mm, God, that's mostly why it cracked um, the home button was because it was above the screen but yeah I guess I don't know I, I expected it to break a like a lot you know just I didn't expect it to break as 
as easy and as soon as it really did. But it did, and now we know. So, anyways, if you enjoyed, please make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And, yeah, this dude has his hatch open, so like the video. And, oh, <laughs> God, I really messed up. Anyways, peace out. Hey, call. Hey, call.